School of Beatbox. Beatbox. Beginner beatboxers, if you have learned the three fundamental sounds, the bass drum, the hi-hat, and the snare drum, and you want to start sounding like a pro beatboxer, I'm gonna show you how by learning just one sound. Check this out. Yes, when I started beatboxing, I had the bass drum down, the hi-hat, and a simple K snare. Started to put them down in two beats, and it wasn't until I learnt one professional sounding snare drum sound, one pro snare to start sounding not a beginner, but like a pro. I will demonstrate it right now. If I do a beat and I'm doing a simple K snare, it will sound like this. I'm going to change nothing but the snare drum. I'm gonna use the inward K snare. Check it out. Pro sounded, right? Check it out. Using the PF snare. Just like that. I'm gonna show you four snare drums right now, very quickly, and you can see which one you are sounding closest to getting, whichever one that is, make it your goal to learn that snare drum and start sounding like a pro. First up, we have the PF snare. It's made by making a P sound, a P sound, and a F sound. Put them together. If you can get close to that sound, maybe this is the snare drum for you. If you can at least get the kind of punch behind the this might be the snare for you because you only have to add to the end of it. The next snare drum, we're gonna look at the inward K snare. Now there's loads of ways that you can learn this one, different techniques. One of my favorite ones is by thinking about Imagining that you are slurping a drink like like this, right? And if you can get that feeling going, it puts your tongue in the right position. What you need to do then is press your tongue to the roof of the mouth so you can't breathe in anymore. When you're in this position, you might feel a little bit awkward, a bit uncomfortable. You can't breathe in, but you're trying to. It's like choking or something, but it's where the magic is. This is the position you need to be in in order to make the inward K snare sound. So once you've got yourself in that position, you then just release the tongue away while breathing in continuously the whole time. So you go. Tongue applied and released. I'll show you one more time. If you're sounding like you're close to this snare, maybe this is the one that you should set your sights on. The third snare is the rim shot snare. Now, this is very closely related to the inward K snare. The difference is you don't breathe air down into your lungs. So the inward K snare will show you the positioning of your tongue and what's actually happening inside the mouth to make that clicking sound. And you basically just do that sound without breathing air into your lungs. If you're getting close to this one, Maybe this is the one for you. Fourth and final snare is one of the originators when it comes to beatboxing, and it's the 808 coming from the Roland TR-808 electronic drum machine. And it sounds like this. The key to making this sound is getting a high pitch sound from the top of the throat here. Okay, which is exactly the same as doing from down here or uh, uh, from up here and you just make it right from the top of the throat. Uh, uh, uh. If you can get this sound actually, it's a gateway. You have access to loads of other cool sound including like plucked stringed instruments and even kind of bowed stringed instruments. Really, really cool stuff. Once you got that, 
If you can make that sound, you can definitely do the 808 snare, because all you need to add then is put them together and you get There you have it guys, four snare drums for you to try. There are loads of other ones, but these four I think are quite easy to get. Practice them, try them out, whichever one you feel you are closest to getting, set your sights on that one. Practice, 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 learn a pro snare sound. Guys, let me know in the comments which snare drum are you closest to getting. If you already have a pro snare, which one is it? If you've got more than one pro snare, which one did you learn first? I find it really, really interesting which snare drum people learn first because it's different for everyone. Awesome stuff. Guys, that is the end of this video. I hope you found it helpful. Peace and love.